Lauren Luke may not be a household name yet, but to 34 million YouTube viewers, she is much more. CBS News correspondent Richard Roth explains. Hi everyone, as promised, I'm back and I'm going to be doing a, a back to school look. In the 18 months she's been doing this, talking to the camera as if it's a girlfriend. It's not going to line your lashes properly. Then sharing makeup tips with a few million strangers. Take a darker green. 27 year old Lauren Luke has become one of the hits of YouTube. So you're just flicking it up at the outer corner. A single mother from Northeast England, she quit her job as a taxi dispatcher and started selling makeup on eBay. When buyers began asking for help, she started giving lessons. Her YouTube channels, now among the most popular on the web, ranked ahead of Barack Obama, National Geographic, and even CBS. I've already primed my eye. In the the amateur way. looks not just appealing, it's authentic. She says she doesn't know how to edit video and didn't take a makeup lesson till after she'd become an internet celebrity. Hi everyone, tonight we're going to be doing a Mardi Gras look. And I really Lauren says her on-camera self-assurance masks a self-confidence crisis she faced in school when she was bullied for her looks and her weight. Zoom, zoom. Now, her homegrown talents turning into a business. We have Amy Winehouse, Style Eyes. I really hope that you enjoyed, because I enjoyed doing it. Richard Roth, CBS News, London. So there you go. Lauren Luke, good morning. Good morning. 34 million hits on YouTube. My yes. goodness. Why do you think you're so popular with people? I think it's because I tell it how it is. Um, I'm nothing to be intimidated, intimidated by or jealous of, and I think I speak for a lot of the women out there who are ready for something new. How did you come up with this idea? Well, I didn't come up with the idea in makeup terms. It was mostly to help us with eBay and show people how applicated it was. Um, so I'd done the videos on YouTube and it, it just took off. People were begging for more. You mean, would you walk around with like various, you know, eye makeup and people would constantly ask you how to do it? And Yes, they would. How have you done that? Or will that look go with my blue eyes, brown eyes? And, and it just made perfect sense to start the YouTube videos. And then after you started them, what happened? Well, it just kind of roller coastered. People were begging for more, and I thought that was lovely. And once I'd done more, it made us want to do lots more for them all. And then in um, a year into it, someone asked for the Leona Lewis look. Mm -hmm. And that's when it completely snowballed. Wow. What is, how would you describe the Leona Lewis look? And like, talk me through it. Teach me, like, if I said, yeah, how do I get those Leona Lewis eyes? Well, it's a really gorgeous dark green smoky look. And I think it would go with any eye colour. And it was requested from our Bleeding Love video. Is this you demonstrating how to do it? Yes, it is. <laughs> now, how do you decide what looks you're going to teach on your website? Is it people write in or you just decide what you like and what's creative, what's going to look good? It's a little of both. I get lots of requests. People say, will you do a look from this picture? They'll send us a link or a video. Usually, if I have to make it up myself, I just switch the camera on. I don't even give it a thought and just go with the floor and see what I come up with. But how did you learn how to do makeup so well? Because Richard Roth just, just said in his story, you didn't take a formal makeup lesson until after this YouTube sensation, right? No, I started just, you know, just however I do it in my own bedroom. There's no professional training or anything. Um, a year into it, I thought, you know what, I best go and get a little bit of a qualification on it. So I took an evening class and I um, qualified in the September, just gone. What did you learn? Did they teach you anything you didn't already know? No. I learned all the <laughs> basics, though. I learned how to really prime the face, which I didn't know before. What does that mean, really prime the face? Prime the face into a canvas so you've got, you're have got you ready to put your makeup on. You've got all your spots evened out and everything like that, and I didn't know all of that. How do you prime the face? Give, give me some <laughs> lessons. Give me some tips here. Moisturise, then a bit of foundation, the concealer, the contour, the blush, a bit of bronzer to get rid of any you know imperfections and things like that. But I used to just go straight on there with no makeup on my face and just put eyeshadow on. <laughs> and did you see a difference after you took this formal lesson, the, the makeup application after you primed the face properly? Oh yes, it does help, definitely. And then is that when you got the 34 million <laughs> hits afterwards? It, it's been increasing ever since. What's your best makeup tip you can give to people out there, no matter what age they are or you know what look they want to achieve? I think it would have to be a steady little finger on your cheek when you're applying liquid liner to get nice even. Oh, so don't have the shaky hand, you just, you so don't have how, show hand. me, how do you, how do you do it? Hold your little applicator on your fingers. Okay. Stick your little finger on your cheek uh -huh. and just guide it. Do you go from outer corner to the inner corner or inner corner to the outer corner? I usually start from the halfway in. Uh-huh. 
and out and uh -huh. then join it up all with your little finger on your cheek. And I find that really helps because I used to get it all over the place before. And then if I want the Amy Winehouse, just keep on keep going like going. this. <laughs> Lauren Luke, thanks so much. Thank you for having us. It's been lovely. You're welcome.